Hello everyone and welcome back to Corey Loses, where today we are continuing our Sins of a Solar Empire playthrough in Star Wars Thrawn's Revenge 2 Ascendancy as a New Republic. Uh, we, in the last few episodes, managed to get attacked by a giant Imperial fleet. We beat back a Ciruvi invasion, but the Penistar alignment and the Imperial remnant are making quite a big problem for us around here. Uh, so Savoria, I think we're just going to write off. Uh, let's take a look at this fleet a bit more. We do have the ion cannon firing away there. It's really not, it's not going to stop all these guys. It doesn't do any hull damage, so it can't. But uh, I'm not going to try to defend that. Probably extend it a bit too far that way. And we're going to try to get EDO rung first. So we do have a our main fleet here. We have all that stuff. And we can get a couple more squadrons. So hopefully the Penistar alignment fleet isn't there. Uh, but we do have Battle Dragon. Where's our Sea Ruby ship? Do we still have any Sea Ruby ships? Doesn't look like it. I thought we had a Shree still. I know one of them got destroyed. Oh well. Um, let's take a look. I did uh, go from my apartment to my parents' place since I, rec I recorded the first three episodes at the same time, and I'm just going to recording them as we do them, or as they happen from, uh, I'm staying at my parents' house right now. So, it's been a couple days since I played. I'm a little, little disoriented. Where was, there we go, that is our capital ship yard. So, uh, we're doing okay for resources. I want to get a couple more Dauntless Cruisers in. Because we can get Edeo Rung, and then we can get uh, just a solid front line here. That'll be better for us. Let's see. Agents. Our golem platforms aren't going to be enough to just defend any of this. We just have so many fighters, so many... Well, I mean, we have no fleet, so... Uh, let's get a couple proficients. I was hoping they'd fight each other a bit more. But what do we got? Okay, so this is, this is going to be easy enough to take. Uh, crap. Just had to alt-tab to make sure it was recording properly, because I don't have both my monitors here. I usually have the recording stuff on one monitor and the game on another. Uh, but I was only able to bring down the first monitor, so I can't see uh, my OBS right now. What do we got there? Let's... Let's still send up the Gallifrey here. We'll start off by bombing the planet rather than waiting. A planet is under attack. Scanners online. We're still going to be getting some scouting done with one of their scouts. Policy research complete. What? Where can we build another civic research station? There we go. We want to get as much culture as we possibly can. Okay. The Senate won't approve. There we go. Oh, they got. Ready. And Star Fleet is coming in. All right, we gotta be ready. That Architens is done for. If anyone shoots, you can. Yep. There we go. They have a lot of capital ships. Gun crews, make ready. I guess we'll focus on the Praetor. Because they're probably going to draw away 
or attacks from the ISDs with it, with the bulwark ability. And I'd rather not have their repair droids repair all the damage they do. Where is the threat? We need to do some more still some more ability stuff. Carrier um, on station. Get these guys away so they're In not Oh god. Policy research complete. We do have a lot of bulwarks already. Or Dauntlesses, not bulwarks. All our capital ships are finally starting to come in. All that damage was done with just our frigates. Did we take the planet out? No. Rip MC-40. One of our star cruisers is heavily damaged. That's too bad. Can we just capture that? We can't. Oh my god. That is amazing. No idea why I'm naming that. Just felt like that would be a good thing to name it. Okay, we need to make sure that it doesn't die. That's the main thing. Now. Oh, we got an ISD as well. Oh, this is perfect. From a balancing standpoint, I'd rather tone it down, actually. But from a I-want-all-their-ships standpoint, I'm perfectly happy to just take them. Alright, so we definitely need... Uh, I need to check out the targeting stuff for these two ships because they do seem to have some issues with that. Uh, but let's get these guys out with the main fleet. And we need a lot of fleet tenders. The enemy has engaged our forces. The Senate won't approve. And there we go. We should get that planet, and I think we're going to go for Fabrini after that. Oh, they're attacking. They're still... Like, I knew they were attacking there, obviously, but they're still pushing on territory here. So do we just leave the PA and try to defend the Remnant? Where are they going? They're just going through? Hold on. The Senate won't approve funding for that. That's good for the Senate. I am the Senate. Crews are ready. All right, we got the planet. They're not sending their whole fleet in. It's an allegiance, but like, what are they jumping to? Policy research complete. Are they trying to reinforce at Hague's? Why? We have liberated another world. There's no reason to do that. Planet is under attack. Whatever, I'm just gonna sell all that stuff. And we'll try to just build up a giant wall of golems. It actually is still worth it to buy golem ones. You can spread them out a bit more, and then uh even though you're ultimately getting a bit less firepower, it has more possible targets for its banks. We so they can shoot multiple targets at once, whereas the golem threes, if you have only a few of them, you're only gonna be shooting a few things. 
and it's harder to deal with bigger fleets that way. Hangar deck secure. Wing commanders report ready. All pilots make ready. Wing commanders report ready. All pilots make ready. All right, where? Where's that Gallifrey? Our reinforcements are here. We still yes. have a shot. And that's all the culture there. Sorry if the audio is a bit more messed up than it has been in the previous episodes. Still trying to get a decent recording set up here. Because I had to move, obviously, away from my actual desk. Alright, so they are going for hapes, it looks like. Hopefully we can build up enough defenses before they take anything over. Yeah, I kind of just want to go and kill the IR. We'll, we'll go for Galanor, and then we can just send that fleet down through. We have finished the planetary upgrade. We do need another policy research complete. I'm going to upgrade more of that, and then we're going to build a second fleet. The Senate won't approve funding for that. The Senate won't approve funding. It's still good to have the worst capital ships just because of the boarding. Hostile culture is too strong. So hopefully once we go to Galanor and take out some of the culture stations are there, the that should help. Our forces. The damage we're getting out of that is actually not bad. It should distract them for long enough for us to do what we need to do elsewhere anyways. Policy research complete. Send in a bunch of bombers. Keep them occupied. Looks like we are going for the remnant. We have established a garrison in the new there we go. system. And we'll get these guys. Just fight back against their culture there. Do not permit any more structures. And then we can just leave this half of the galaxy for a while. This is the captain. The Senate won't approve funding for that. We have finished a planetary upgrade. It looks like we actually did take out the the Allegiance. With just the Golans. And the Iron Cannon, actually. Where's our constructors? Whatever. I'll just let those do what they're doing. We have finished a planetary upgrade. I wish you could make the AI more picky about what it builds as far as capital ships go, because it is really just random. They know when to build a capital ship, they don't know what kind to build. Because, like, really you don't want more than a couple dominators. They're good to have, but... 
because the AI is going to randomly build some, you can sometimes end up with this. A garrison has been forced off world. A planet is under attack. We just lost Savoria, that's not too we bad. Finished the planetary upgrade. And I guess we'll just try to take out that stuff with whatever can't fight the or can't bomb the planet. Let's send a smaller group of these guys out. Take the goal one. You know, we have enough capital ships. Even the ones with the bombard ability, we don't need. And they're heading back. Perfect. Keep pumping culture into their area too. We have finished the planetary upgrade. I'm kind of afraid of if they attack from Stalsonek to Thrakia. much laser. So much laser. That makes sense. So much laser fire. So many lasers. Either of those would be preferable to what I actually said. Um, it's all gone. That's a... They have another frigate shipyard here? Why? Why did I allow this? We have liberated another world. I guess it'll be just because of the culture we can't really capture yet. Probably not worth it going to Baldavia. But if we can really... Hmm. Do we want to take the Remnant? Or do we just want to take the Penistrel Element first? Because the Remnant's the one that I'm afraid of attacking, but... Yeah, we we can just come up through. Well, yeah, we're going that way. Ignore me. The remnant is the bigger threat, even though they have less territory right now. Planet is under attack. We do need to stop them from doing this. Uh, where's that actually that can hold that off with a couple of golems for help and these quasars we have established a garrison in the new system. there we go we'll we'll just fly through Baldavia and we'll get back to taking Savoria. These guys up. Okay. That'll be fine. Scanners online. I kind of just want to make them go on their own as fast as possible. We have reached our designated coordinates. Oh my god. If we can draw them back, because I don't think we can. If they're really committed to this, I don't think our fleet's going to get there in time.
I just have so much stuff. That smaller fleet's definitely not going to get here in time, and that's not going to be enough. But if we can get up through here and cut them off, then fly up through the back. Like, if we take out all their territory first, there's nothing they can do. And hopefully that'll, again, draw them back into, into their own lands. We do have some golems here. That should be enough to hold them off. It won't be enough to actually beat them. I don't think. It's fine. Yeah, our fleet's starting to get through. Cursed or <laughs> Just hang up by the edge of the gravity gravity well, you're gonna get there faster anyways. Our reinforcements are here. We still have a shot. Yeah, the quasars are in. Full. Oh bombs. Uh Strike run coming. Going on there's VSD. See if you can do anything like that. The enemy has engaged our forces. Policy research complete. Our culture is at least taking over. We're going to be at an advantage everywhere because we do have the culture. The quasars themselves should fly in behind everything. These guys. It'll be best if we can capture some of their units, just to soak up the fire. The endurance, we got single interference with that, yes. Perfect. If we can capture this ISD, actually. There's another MC-80B coming in. Let's get the EMP burst. There you go. We're starting to make some progress in. We'll be able to retake Savoria. Because our culture's already really strong there, luckily. I think Jodaka overthrew them. Yeah, our culture actually took this planet away from them. One of our star cruisers is heavily damaged. Which one? Yeah, both of them. A star cruiser has been lost. A These guys are just a distraction, so it doesn't really matter. Uh, let's build up that extra fleet now. We're gonna get a bunch of MC nineties. A couple of these guys. And a bunch of Dauntless. Oh. oh yeah, I should get some constructors as well. Nah, we'll show off that stuff later. We're gonna be on the offensive more. I should have built star bases earlier on. A lot of their upgrades still aren't done, so yeah. But we can just take the planet. Take a planet, leave a planet. Reinforcements are here. This poor MCB ADB. Left to die. All these carriers. But it's it's just been uh, the golems that they've been getting, so it doesn't matter. That's what they're there for. They're there to pull them off a bit, stop them from taking the infrastructure. Hangar deck secured. Relocating. And we'll jump together for this. Because there's a bit of a defense fleet there. 
Not much of one, but still enough. What is that actually? 8 Carex, 6 Star Cruisers, 16 it's Lancers, 10 Ton Falks, 5 VSDs, a VSD2, and 10 Dreadnoughts. Not too bad of a fleet. I think, did we kill the ISD? Did I read that? No, I don't think... Yeah, the ISD we killed. So it took us four capital ships, but we killed it. I'm not sure how many frigates, if any, we managed to kill. For the last one, though, I also want to... Uh, where do we go? Did we not research the fight count? Oh, we don't have enough... Here. There we go. We need to complete further policy research. Yeah, we just can't use it because uh, we lost the structure, so that's fine. These guys... Did I just not, not even wait for them? Now because I just gave that order, they're not going to be there either. Right, we already had to research these for the, the health bonus because they were attacking here earlier. These guys are just going to stay there and do that. And we can just turn around and come back for it. So it doesn't matter. That's fine. The enemy has engaged our forces. And the pedestal alignment's pushing him in on the other side, too. We have finished the planetary upgrade. A planet is under attack. What are your orders? I'm just going to speed her up a bit until they actually get in position to jump. And will we... Reinforcements are here. We still have a shot. Build. We need to complete further policy research. Is that not built yet? There we go. Our current policies do not permit any more orbital structures. There we go. And... We'll get a buy count for next one. Reporting. Right, they're so getting ready to jump. We have finished the planetary upgrade. So they might actually take that planet down, but they won't be able to colonize it, so we can just fly back through and recolonize it ourselves. Uh, and I'm not too concerned about building more ships, because we've got that extra fleet being built already. We have finished the planetary upgrade. That's fine. All ahead full. Because our fleet's already the biggest. Like, we're listed as second, but I think that's based on the number of ships. It's not... Because uh, we're always going to have less ships than in two Imperial factions will. That's just the way this faction will work. Or I mean, we're not always good, because like, at some point we're just going to kill all their ships. But I mean, as far as like relative values, us having fewer, it's technically not a big deal. What is this? Galanor? Mm. That's not great, but it's not terrible. Keep selling stuff. We'll need more Duras. Oh my god. Didn't mean to keep selling stuff. There we go. Get the Y count. The enemy has engaged our forces. Let's watch the battle now. One of our star cruisers is heavily damaged. Star cruiser has been lost. Get those icons out of the way. Okay, we got the allegiance down. Now it's just the frigates. Where's our Praetor? Oh, they're leaving. Got to take all the Taunt Falcons out.
Where is the Praetor? Oh, there we go. There's one. A planet is under attack. Would have been nice to get one of the interdictors. Someday we might replace maybe the proficient with an interdictor for them. If we have a suitable ship for it. Alright. They haven't taken Thrakia yet. They seem to have pulled back a few of their ships there as well. Ooh, it's still not, not a bad fleet, really. Not a good fleet, but not a bad one. Jumping away from the planet, we actually took one of the Lancers, too, because we have the uh, open arms deck. There's a Pentastar Praetor. We can technically take this planet, too. Where is it? We need... Guy. And I think that'll do it for this episode, though. So next episode, we're going to finish off the Remnant. And probably... Possibly finish off the entire campaign. So... That'll be up on Friday, I believe. So thank you for watching, everyone. And I will see you next time. I guess.